Welcome to another episode of Jay Leno's Garage. I guess this would fall under the restoration blog section because this is what you'd use in a restoration. This is called the Easy V-Jack. And it's one of those products that I like because it's made in America by Americans. And it's a small company. You know, what we try to do here on the website is if someone has an automotive related product and maybe they can't afford to advertise in some of the big car magazines, whatever it might be, uh, we try to help them out because we get a pretty good viewership and our people like to buy stuff from Americans, especially uh, products built by veterans. And this is one of those little products that's kind of started in the garage and is really quite cool. Let's meet the Steve Davis. Steve, come on in. You're the, you're the president of the company? Yes, sir. And, you, and your kids work in the company as well? Yes. So you get to be boss at home and boss at work. That's pretty good. That's right. That's okay. Right. So tell me about the idea for this. I have a uh, barn with a number of cars and I wanted to be able to move them around easily. And I found that uh, some of the products that we had have a lot of small wheels underneath each of the tires and it's hard to move them back and right. forth. So I figured, well, you need larger wheels, you need uh, a fewer number of wheels, you need something that is easily adjustable. And I said, Gosh, I think I can do a better job than that, and I did. Okay. So that was the whole reason it started. And it's all nicely welded, pretty strong. This is uh, not a lightweight product, but it's for moving trucks and cars and heavy right. equipment. And you can use a floor jack, right? You put the floor jack under the differential, you lift, and this will slip right underneath it. That is what it's designed for. Right. It's high enough that it'll clear a floor jack. You just lay the handle down, it'll go right up and around it. So that's why the open arms at the end clears the floor jack, lets it go right up underneath where it needs to go. Right, this works exactly the way a lift, like our lifts over there work, our bend pack lifts, and then the arms adjust to wherever the frame rails are, exactly. whatever part of the car you're gonna lift, lift up. And you would need, uh, well obviously you need two, one for the front of the car, one for the back. Right. I suppose you could just use the back if you're going to just swing it around, couldn't you? That's well, we have it at one of the uh, local car dealerships, and they're in their body shop. They, they would put one underneath the front or the back if there right. was a, an accident, move it out, get the parts for it, move it back in again, and they don't have to use two of them at that time. Right, okay. And obviously, you've got locking wheels here, right? So that's, so you can, the wheel is directional. Just the one wheel up in the front, this the one vertex here. caster. Okay. And well, let's show how it opens up. Now you have your two sons, Hoss and Little Joe here. Coming that's right, in. that's right. Help out, there you go. This is Matt and Dave. Hi guys. They can show you how this is actually um, easily adjustable. The arms open all the way up to about uh, 90 degrees. It gives you almost 42 inches from side to side between the saddles. So most frames and so on are within that. Uh, yeah within that width. So just about any, certainly any American car right. would fit in there. And obviously if you're doing a Camaro or a Mustang, uh, it's a lot safer than, uh, you know, I have a lot of idiot friends of mine. They put the jack on the differential then they pull the floor jack right. and then they right. hit a bump and it falls off the floor jack. Now they've broken the brake rotors because the wheels aren't. I mean, you know, we've all been there. And that's, uh, this is really sturdy, heavy duty construction. And uh, you guys are veterans too. You have some veterans. You're what, 22 years? Maybe? Right, 22 years in okay. the, uh, the military. Okay, very cool. So uh, we, we've kind of downrated. Each unit will be able to hold 4,000 pounds. So a set holds most vehicles in the market under 8,000 pounds right, okay. fairly easily. Now show, uh, have the guys show how the wheels lock. Uh, Show how that works. See, most products like this, the wheels just kind of flops right. around when they, you move it. They this, caster. Way, this way, and you can lock the wheel in any, any place you want. So, there you go. Yeah. I found in my circumstances, a, uh, if you have any kind of an incline, the, the car is going to want to go that way. Right. So, if you are able to steer one wheel, then you can put it right where you want to. Then one person can do it. Yeah, yeah. And what does the set of these go for? What does one of these go for? We charge $9.99 okay. for a set, and you get two of these at that time. You get it shipped in three boxes. They, of course, have to be assembled, but this is all the. This is exactly what you get. So some assembly required, as they yes, say. Yes, you have yeah. to yeah. be able but to But as you can that see, out. it's pretty easy to put together. Just a matter of putting the four, the four bolts on here on each wheel. You know, we've had a couple of people who've come up with great ideas for products, and they've approached manufacturers and manufacturers will say especially some of the big box stores oh yeah we'll buy your product but it's got to be made in china and it's this and we'll pay you this much and a lot of them don't like that idea whereas have you run into any of those kind of problems without 
naming names so I don't get sued. People have told us we should be going to different manufacturers and right. we're just kind of dedicated to where we're at right now in the process. Yeah, so I mean, I think that's great. You have guys that are veterans and you've got a few other veterans working for you as well. Right. And uh, this, is, uh, this is what they do. They build stuff to military spec and military quality. So it's pretty cool. Now you can go to their website and you can see the whole video. If you have any other questions, I'm sure it'll be explained there. What's the website again? EasyVJack.com. Okay. Just our name up there, .com. Okay. Very good. Very good. Well, nicely done and uh, good luck with it. And thanks for your service. We appreciate that too. Thank you, Jay. Appreciate okay. it.